second question that we have here that has been sent to me is the question is it okay to listen to those people whose minhaj is unknown like uh, Ustad Nu'man Ali Khan the salaf of this ummah rahimahumullah ta'ala they used to pay attention to who they took knowledge from knowledge should not be taken from someone who is majhul he's not known his qualifications his competence is not known Ibrahim and Nakhi for an example Zayd ibn Aslam for an example Al Imam Hamid ibn Salim Hassan al Basri um, Ta'us all of them have been reported and it's been recorded that they used to say to the people Rahimahumullah ta'ala inna hadha al ilm deenun fanduru amman ta'khudun al deenakum this religion this knowledge is your religion so beware be careful of those people who you are taking knowledge from and the reason why they took that position is because they were afraid that a person may come to take knowledge from someone who is unknown and he has the ability to slip poison and teachings that are against the religion so taking knowledge from people who are known is something that is imperative in knowledge of hadith ilm al hadith in the chain of narration one of the conditions for the hadith to be authentic is that each and every narrator has to be acceptable he has to be known he has to be known the hadith of the majhul if a person is unknown that hadith is rejected because he's bringing to the table ambiguity so we have to take knowledge from people who are known for knowledge and for al istiqamah